So what is statelessness? Statelessness is when a person is not recognized by a state or a country as having citizenship. And this is a really big problem for a lot of people around the world because people often find themselves in situations such as with the Soviet Union where a country falls apart and they're not granted citizenship. A good example, in Canada we've accepted a lot of refugees from Nepal that are from Bhutan and were denied citizenship and forcefully removed into ne Nepal and as a result don't have a country. And so that is really what it means to be without a state. And in 1954 the United Nations came up with the convention um, relating to the status of stateless people and the idea there is to protect people from statelessness. And unfortunately, Canada has still uh, neglected to sign this convention. And that has a huge impact here in Canada. In Canada, we also have the unfortunate situation that was passed or became law in 2009 that related to individuals um, who are second generation born outside the country. So what that means is somebody, their parents are Canadian and they go and they live abroad and they have a child and then their child has a child also outside of the country and that person is denied citizenship to Canada. And so we've seen a lot of impacts and mostly the biggest impact is that people don't have access to services. These things include education, housing, and economic supports, and these have really devastating impacts on the lives of people both here inside Canada and outside of Canada. What we're recommending is that not only that Canada sign the 1954 convention relating to the status of stateless people, but that we also amend the Citizenship Act so that no children of Canadian parents are, find themselves without citizenship abroad. Do Brasil ao Iraque, vai segurando.